Hi Aries, welcome to your reading. This is a general love reading. It may or may not resonate with all of you. Now let's start. First let's shuffle four times the deck. I will use this other deck. Let's start with what happened in the past, so you know if it is your reading or not. What challenges happened in the past? It seems like no matter how focus or attention you gave to this connection, it couldn't be successful. It seemed like a complete failure, and maybe one of the causes was the other person may have been quite guarded, not opening up much emotionally or not being much vulnerable. Now let's see about your current energies. But you are finding it very difficult to move away from this past connection. You may have decided in the recent past to move away, but you are finding it, it is not easy. And uh, somehow, deep inside yourself, your wish is to be with them. Your wish is to be with them. Now let's see more details about what may be affecting you in your subconscious. The fact that this connection may have ended completely, the cycle is over and there's nothing that can be done there. This is something that may affect you in your subconscious. Now let's see about what is the overall energy for Aries. It seems like... Uh, if there's been a silence treatment, it will continue like this. No communication, no talking with each other and remaining uh, silent. Also, there's a possibility of not knowing completely uh, the truth, even though the intuition is telling something. Uh, intuition is always right, that feeling we get. and uh, But sometimes we need to see the facts and... Uh, just to verify that uh, what we feel is true. But I think you may not have enough clarity about this whole situation and you need more information to be extra sure if it is worth revisiting this past connection or not. Let's see more details about what may be affecting you in your... Sorry, uh, how do you view the situation? How do you view the situation with them? It may have been a celebrated love, like marriage, engagement, or a long-term commitment, or there were plans to build something important to celebrate the love together with them. Now let's see more details. Your hope is that uh, you will be in a connection soon that is harmonious, fair, and not one-sided than uh, that this last connection. And uh, you want to avoid being stuck in the past. You want to move forward. You want to see progress. Now let's see what are their energies. What are their energies at this moment? For now, they think uh, this connection is a complete drama. They want to avoid another ending, another hurtful ending there. That's why they don't want to put much focus and energy right now in that past connection with you. Now let's see their possible actions towards you, if any, for the time frame of this reading. That is the last week of May. Ten of Swords in the reverse. Uh, they think uh, this connection was very hurtful. It may have been a betrayal. Now, I don't know who did something wrong. Even if they did something wrong, they think that they cannot revisit the past um, because it ended in a very bad way. And it may be hurtful to, to confront again uh, what happened in the past. So, for now, they want to avoid it and also they think if it was revisited immediately immediately now it would cause uh, again lots of pain and it may be a short-lived connection anyway i want to continue this reading to see how it goes in the extended where you will get more details 
If you want to watch the extended, you can find it now in the description box below. See you the next reading and bye for now.